so basically it's kind of simulating a glower unit. I mean, it's not perfect because there is no static pressure on the, on the unit, but the first, first here is going to show the way the, the motor slowly ramps up. So it doesn't just come right on and bang, produce a whoosh of air, um, kind of ramps itself up. This is the low 600 RPM constant fan operation on the motor. So basically what this is simulating is someone's got their thermostat set to on. All right? It's running not on auto, but it's always running the fan. So the first switch here is up to speed now. You can see the this is a watt draw, 118 watts on there. This is a call for heat or cool. So it's going to slowly ramp itself up to the speed. It's probably about up to speed now, 213 watts. So this is a restriction in the air airflow. You can hear the motor kind of ramp itself up. More RPMs, more, more horsepower. You can see the added draw on the electricity. Larger restriction. Again, this is constant torque at work on a motor. <laughs> so when they get a loaded filter, when they get the restrictions, it's going to overcome that. So we'll drop this back down to its uh, constant fan speed. And then we'll kick on, this is the pulse width modulator. So we're going to go ahead and turn that on. It's going to slowly ramp up to speed. I've got it set on its lowest speed possible right now. Probably about 350 RPM. Give it about a quarter turn there. You'll see it go ahead and ramp up. This is where a guy could dial in his airflow, his CFM, however he wanted it. He doesn't think that's enough. Give it another turn. A little red light in here is telling him how fast he's running, essentially whether it's full speed or reduced speed. The red light will dim or bright as he turns it up. So again, this is constant, uh, constant torque. So we cover it up. We're just going to ramp up the speed and RPM. Well, it's better to use it, but it's going to provide the airflow. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah.